Okay, no, the right answer is D. Now, I agree some of these other things are true. For example, the polar regions do have sinking motion and the tropical regions have rising motion, but that isn't why the poles are cold and the tropics are warm. Maybe it's kind of the other way around. The fact that the tropics are warm is why there's rising motion. Um, I also think it's true that in general the polar regions are farther from the sun, but that is not why they are colder. Uh, after 93 million miles of passing through cold, dead space, the rays of sun don't lose a whole lot of their fraction, you know, fraction of their intensity traveling that last few hundred miles from the equator uh, to the poles, and that's just not uh, the factor. It's about D, how the sun's rays hit at a lower angle in the polar regions than they do in the tropical regions. All right, not a hugely important point in a class about wind.